Hi my sweeties, welcome back to my channel. So today we're doing a Louis Vuitton wallet collection and mini review on each of them. I'm also going to be sharing some different options that you could have for wallets with Louis Vuitton that are less expensive. And I have been asked on my Instagram a few questions on some of the wallets that I own from Louis Vuitton, so I'm happy to fulfill that request. So let's just get started. I will start with the first wallet that I acquired with Louis Vuitton and it is the French purse. And this is what it looks like. It is in the vernis leather and it is in the color Palme d'Amour. They no longer make this color, but there are definitely lots of variations of the vernis colors that they have out. This was a limited edition color and it has the monogram embossed all the way through. One continuous piece of canvas. Okay, and then it has the button closure in the front, which opens up to eight credit card slots. We have five on this side and three on the other. And then we have two slip pockets. So we have one here and the other one right behind it. And I tried to see if you can fit a passport in there, but you cannot. Um, it would be great if you could, but not so much. Okay, and this wallet was made in France. Let's see if you guys can see that up close. Okay, and then it also has a pocket for cash on the top. And then on this side, it has a, an opening for the coins. And it's really pretty because it has like a really nice LV engraved inside. I'll show you on the gold hardware. And on the opposite side, it has it as well, but I'm not sure if you can see it because of the the tab. There it is. Okay, so that is what the French purse looks like from Louis Vuitton. And this piece, I really enjoy it. Actually, um, I have used it quite a few times in my smaller handbags, and I really, really enjoy using this piece. The only thing I would say about Bernie is that you have to be really careful with it because it definitely can get color transfer very easily. So, for example, if you have receipts or anything like that in your purse, then you really have to be careful with that because it will definitely transfer the print from the receipt onto the actual Bernie. So I'm very careful with that in my bags. And the other thing is that it does stick a little. It's like patent, like if you feel patent leather and how that feels, it actually does stick to other Verni items. So for example, I have the clay in Verni as well in the Palme d'Amour. And if I were to put it up against each other and I put it in the purse, then after a while, and even now, if I was to try to like take it apart, you could hear it. I'm gonna not talk real quick so you can hear. You hear that sound? It's like it's like they're sticking to each other. So that's the only thing with that. And so I tend to, if I'm gonna carry both of these in my bag, then I usually make sure that they're separated and put them like you know in a different spot, just so that they're not rubbing up against each other. But the Bernie is definitely durable in terms of you know it not scratching as easily. And there is the whole thing with the fingerprints. I find that Palme d'Amour more though, I don't get a lot of fingerprint issues with it. Um, and it's just really easy to wipe down if you do. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. And again, this is the Bernie French Purse by Louis Vuitton. Okay, so the next wallet that I have here is the Josephine wallet. And this one I'm actually currently using and this is what it looks like. And it has the red button closure, which tells you that it's red interior. And it just has the four credit card slots here. And then it has an open slot for maybe like cash if you wanted to use it for that reason. I'm just gonna open it like this so you can see. And then also it has another slip pocket here. And then it has another slip pocket here. And this one goes all the way down to the bottom of the actual wallet. This here is the coin purse that it comes with. And it's great for using it just as a separate wallet if you wanted to as well. I want to share with you that you can definitely fit your passport in there, your cell phone. If you have an iPhone 6, it definitely fits in there, no problem. So I have my iPhone 6 here and you can just pop it right in 
the pocket, just like that. And you can close it up and just use it as like a little clutch if you wanted to as well. So I really like this wallet. The Josephine comes in different canvases. The price point is excellent as well. And this is a wallet that I will definitely continue to keep in my collection for a really long time. Okay, the next wallet that I have is the Zippy Coin Purse. And this one is in the Evasion Collection Limited Edition in the monogram. And it has the zip around. So on the back, it's just the plain monogram. It is one continuous piece of canvas. And then it has the zipper pull, and the zipper pull does have Louis Vuitton on it. I'll just show you so you guys can see. Okay. And then it just zips around. And on the inside, because it's limited edition, it does have the pink interior, which I absolutely love. I think it's super beautiful. There you go, guys. And it has five credit card slots, so two on this side and then two on the other, right there. And then you have a credit card slot in the middle. You have an open compartment here, and then an open compartment on the other side. You have a slip pocket behind the credit card slots, right here. And on the other side as well, another slip pocket. So I really, really love this wallet. It's awesome. It fits a ton and it's nice and compact to fit in your smaller bags. So I use this a lot in my uh, Alma BB and I use it in the Eva clutch and I've used it in the Toiletry 26 as well. So I really, really love this wallet. Okay, so the next wallet that I have is the Adele wallet. And this is one of the wallets I've also gotten some questions about in terms of different ways you can use it. So this particular one is in the monogram and it is again one continuous piece of canvas. So the LVs are upside down on the other side. It has the pull tabs which are in the color Coquelicot which is a red with like an orange undertone and the pull tabs are pretty significant in size which are really nice. I, I love it. Some people say that they're cumbersome kind of in the way but I just love 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 those pull tabs. So these have the LVs and the actual grommets so I'm going to try to get as close as I can so you guys can see that. Okay so these have the actual Louis Vuitton on the actual grommets and it's on both sides and then you open it up and it has a magnetic closure. So I'll see if you can hear that. Yeah, definitely can hear that. <laughs> so it just opens up and it's kind of like strong. If you notice, like it was hard for me to kind of open it a little. So it's, it's very secure, definitely for sure. And it has six credit card slots on this side and then six on the other. So 12 all together. And then it has a slip pocket here. And it has another slip pocket on the other side. And then it has these awesome zipper openings on either side, which have the beautiful red interior as well. And this side the same. And I've used this a lot as a clutch, so I will put my cell phone in it on the one side. And then a lot of times I will use my Chanel mirror I'll put in here and then I'll also put like a lip gloss, but it has to be a flat one because otherwise it's not gonna fit in here. And you can just zip it up. And so what I do with the Adele wallet is I attach the pochette extender and this is what it looks like. Okay, so I've attached it to just one of the zipper pulls and then I just put it around my wrist and you can just use it as a really cute clutch. And so I do that a lot which is really fun because you can have your credit cards, your cash with you, your phone, a lipstick and a compact and you're good to go. So I really, really love that. Okay, so that was the Adele wallet in the monogram with the Coquelicot red interior. Okay, and this one was made in France as well. 
Okay, so now we are going to move on to the last wallet that I own with Louis Vuitton. And it's really considered a key pouch, but I see it with the price point being on prompt leather as a wallet and which is the reason why I purchased it to begin with is to use it in smaller bags as a wallet so this is the emprunt clay in the color cerise and it has the LVs embossed throughout so I'll just show you the other side it's one continuous piece of canvas as well and it has the zipper pull here in the back so it has the Louis Vuitton on the actual gold tone hardware and the grommets on both sides. Okay, and then it has a zipper opening in the back, which you can put like a license or your most used credit cards back there. And then in the front, it has the Louis Vuitton on the button closure. And it has the key ring for you know for your keys obviously and it has the LV on there as well on both sides and then inside it's just an open pocket that you can use for your credit cards your license and this fits a lot definitely lots of credit cards and everything you would need so I definitely consider this a wallet for sure especially considering the price point I definitely think it's right up there with the Josephine wallet that's why I put it in with the wallets. Okay, so now we're gonna go over some options that you can do that are less expensive for wallets with Louis Vuitton. Okay, so the first one that I would say is a really good option for a wallet would be the clay or the key pouch by Louis Vuitton. And this one is in monogram. I find that this one compared to the one in Damier Ben and Damier Azor, this one in particular fits a lot more. I feel like the canvas is more pliable, softer, a little wider even. This one would be a lot better in terms of if you want to use a lot of credit cards and your license and cash and coins and things like that. And then of course you have the clasp for your keys that you can attach, which is nice. And it just has the interior is brown on this one. So there you go. This one's definitely my favorite as a wallet. I would say I use it all the time as a wallet and I use it in the mini pochette lots. So I think that this one would be a great option. Okay, so the next item that I think would be great as a wallet option would be the clay in Vernie. And they have many different colors in the Vernie. This particular one comes with the actual plate that says Louis Vuitton. They now make them without the plate, so it no longer comes with the plate, but I'm sure you can get it pre-loved um, with it if you prefer. So again, with the LV embossed throughout, and this one has two pieces of Vernie leather, so they're both right side up. Okay, and this one has a pocket here that you can put your most used credit card or license, and then in here, it's plenty of room that you can put all of your other credit cards that you wanna use. So definitely a great option as a wallet if you wanted to use it that way. And it has like the accordion style, so it definitely expands and you can use it to put your business cards if you wanted to as well. And this particular one has the pull tab and it does have the Louis Vuitton on both sides of the grommets as well. And again, you can attach your keys to it and you're good to go. So I think this is a great option for a wallet, definitely. Okay, so that is the Vernie Clay in Palm de Amour. Okay, so the next item that I think would be an awesome option as a wallet would be the Louis Vuitton Agenda PM. And I have it in the Damier event, in the Patchwork Limited Edition. And it just has the illustrations on there of the different Louis Vuitton bags and key ball and things like that. So I'll turn it around so you guys can see the other side. And then the inside has the red interior, which I absolutely love. And I got mine hot stamped. And this one in particular, I believe is made in Spain. Yes, made in Spain. 
So this would make a great wallet because it has the three credit card slots here. It has a slip pocket in the back there. It has another slip pocket here as well. And you can also put a passport in here. So that would make a great wallet as well if you're traveling. And you can put some cash in the back here, your most used credit cards here, and you're good to go. So I definitely think this would be a great option also for a wallet. So there's that. And then I have here the multi-cart, which is the Zippy multi-cart by Louis Vuitton, and it is in the monogram canvas with the uh, Grenade interior, which is kind of like a salmon pink color. And it is one piece of canvas, so there you go. And then it has a pull tab here in the same color as the interior. And then we'll just unzip it. And inside, it's an accordion style. So you have five compartments. And so this would be great for lots of credit cards. You can double up in each compartment too. You can easily have cash as well in there. The only thing is with coins, because the bottom of the compartments are not stitched to the all the way at the bottom, the coins will slip through each compartment. So I wouldn't really suggest, unless it doesn't bother you, but... I don't particularly put coins in here for that reason. And this particular one was made in France. So there you go. Okay, so this would be an excellent option for a wallet, for sure. And it fits quite a bit, and it also fits in a lot of smaller bags. So I love it for that reason. So there you go, that's the Zippy Multicart, and that is in the monogram with the Grenade interior. The next item, that I would say would make a great wallet. And the last one that I have is the mini pochette. And this is a really good option because you can fit so much in here. You can put your credit cards in there, your license, it fits your cell phone. An iPhone 6 is the biggest that it's gonna fit with a case, uh, as long as the case is pretty slim, but definitely can fit lots in this mini pochette. And I think it's a great option as a wallet to start out with because you can use it as a little mini purse when you don't want to use it as a wallet as well. I've done that plenty of times where I just put my phone, my compact mirror, and a lip gloss, and I'm ready to go, and I love it for that. This one is in the Demi Ben with, of course, the red interior like you've seen. I love this little chain that it comes with. It's small, but it definitely fits in the crook of your arm as well, and it's just great. You can use this as a crossbody if you have a strap that you can attach to it, and it's just awesome as a wallet. So definitely the mini pochette is a great option for a wallet. So there you go. And this one, I believe, yes, it was made in France as well. So I'll just show you that. Okay guys, so that is all I have for you today. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. I hope that it was very helpful to everyone. And for those of you who had some questions on Instagram, I hope that I answered all your questions. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Snapchat and Instagram at Beauty and Lux. I'll have the link down below. And I hope you guys have a wonderful and blessed day.